Welcome to Iliad Cohen. We in Gay PB Magazine are very honored to have you here sharing your time with us and talking a little bit about your career and your projects and everything. So we are so happy. Thank you very much for your time. And Thank you for so, having me. Yes, yes, absolutely. And how how are you, Iliad? I'm good. I'm actually I'm great. Working a lot, launching some new ideas, new collections, um, which keep me busy. But I really like it, so I can't complain. That's fabulous, and you look handsome as usual. And sexy. <laughs> um, yes, yes, it's a new look. <laughs> I love it. Okay, let's talk about a little bit about uh, your uh, party's project that is uh, Papa Party, right? Um, so uh, we know that some of these parties and events are uh, uh, getting back to, to life uh, after this COVID situation and everything. So uh, is Papa Party restarted already? Yes, Papa is back. We did actually uh, three weeks ago, we did the Baltimore Pride, and two weeks ago we did Houston Pride. In the end of July, we're gonna do Miami. So mostly in US, I would say, because in Europe, things are still slow with the vaccine, and you know, I think this summer won't be there many events until everybody is like almost everybody is vaccinated and things can open up again. Exactly, that's right. And here things are getting a little lower right but uh, it, it's great and uh, we know that you um, uh, there there was going to be a, a party a papa party in Puerto Vallarta last May uh, but it was cancelled because of the COVID right so are you are you planning to reschedule that party or when or? yeah it was supposed to be actually a festival a four days of parties uh, the whole weekend but we had to cancel because of COVID and obviously we needed uh, uh, to make sure everybody's safe. So yeah, I believe I would love to do this festival maybe next year when things are much more quiet and will be easier to organize everything again. Yes, exactly. And uh, what, what do you think Puerto Vallarta is a, is a great location for, for Papa Party? Puerto Vallarta is a unique place. It's like a small gay village that, you know, you just walk around, you have amazing beach, you have Mantamar, the resort, which is one of the best uh, gay beach resorts in the world. Uh, the people are super friendly, the restaurants are great, the food is delicious. So yeah, I think this is like a really one of the coolest places to, to throw a nice festival. Yeah, that's right. And, and... What is the the, the 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 things that you like better in Puerto Vallarta? Because what I, I like I know most in Puerto Vallarta. The thing that I really like most is that you know just you know you start walk around. You don't even need a car. You just walk in Zona Romantica, and then you see this restaurant, and you see this coffee place, and you see a place to uh, you want to shopping. So you have everything just so accessible. You're just walking around, and everything is so easy and of course the people are super friendly and super welcoming yeah that's right and especially with with uh, big celebrities like you i mean <laughs> but puerto vallarta welcomes everybody Thank the, you. people are very friendly like you said and yeah that's very true and you know that um do you think puerto vallarta i mean in this uh, post-covid uh, new new situation it's moving into one of the top worldwide destination to circuit parties you know so mm -hmm. for some people this is, this can be a little controversial but uh, can you see puerto vallarta as a top circuit circuit destination i think yeah it became especially in the last few years uh it became one of the biggest places to come and have a circuit parties or big weekends and holidays, which is great for the city because a lot of tourists coming, a lot of people from Europe, US, 
coming, spending money, the hotels are full, uh, the restaurants are busy, the business owners um, from Vallarta getting um, more clients, which is perfect for the business. Yes, exactly. And uh, but for example, you that have been uh, traveling around the world, um, that been in many cities in the world, do you, yeah. do, you, uh, do you think that Puerto Vallarta can compete with some Europe uh, big cities for I think circuit? what's unique about Puerto Vallarta is that it's actually it's a unique place. Uh, in places in Europe you don't have what you have in Vallarta. You have in Vallarta, you know, this amazing, as I said, the, the beach club and the beach and the Zona Romantica, which is amazing. Um, and actually, I'm excited to come back. And when I come back, I want to bring my new clothing collection, my new swimsuits that I just launched two or mm -hmm. three days ago, which I'm super excited and it will be perfect for people in uh, Vallarta. Yeah. That's fabulous. And, and I love that to, to know more about your, your brand. Um, if, I mean, but. but um, this is uh, a new store that you have or you have already some time with it? So when the pandemic started, we started the... I, I had to cancel all the parties, so I had a lot of time to be home and to think about new ideas. So we launched a new uh, shoes collection, which wow. went very well. We were, sh we were shipping worldwide. And then we launched the t-shirt collections, which I'm wearing one of them right now. Mm -hmm. And our clients worldwide, they love the, the stuff we did. They love the quality, they love the designs. But we got a lot of messages why we don't have shorts or speedos from the, especially that now it's summer. So four days ago, um, five days ago, we launched the um, swimsuit collections mm -hmm. and it's just crazy how people got excited and we are all day shipping worldwide to everyone and our fans super happy so i'm really really happy and excited about it and by the way that's why i went to madrid because all the swimsuits and the shorts it's all made in spain so we went there we did the photo shoots in spain in axel hotel there and then now we are shipping everything from Spain direct everywhere. Wow, that's that's great. I, I saw um, uh, some of the designs, this uh, shoes line that you are mentioning, and uh, it's fabulous. I mean, fabulous designs. I really mm -hmm. like it very much. Who does the signs? Are you designing or do you I have, have team or Jose and Luis? Uh, that I work with them, uh, Jesus and Jose, not Luis, uh, mm -hmm. that I work with them, they're from uh, Madrid and okay. they're such right. an amazing, talented guy. So we collaborate together and we're doing all this collection, the shoes, the shirts and the swimsuits all together. We FaceTime a lot. Um, Jesus is more the creative side, the designer doing all the stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, so when we FaceTime, we, he show me some examples and new ideas and I tell him, yes, this is, I like this direction, this one I like less, this one I like more. So it's a work team together um, with Jose Jesus and me and I feel like this is a perfect team. Yes, um, I mean, when you see the signs, you can see that it's a really, really careful work. I really love it. Um, yeah, so, yes, you are um, giving ideas and working with them and everything, you know? so that's fabulous, fabulous work. I really like it. What else do you have in the, in the stores? You have the swimwear, you have the shoes, you have shirts. What Shirt and we have tank top. And I'm sure with the time we're going to expand and have some more stuff, maybe hats and socks and underwear. But this is for the future. Right now we're focusing on this. And now when it's summer, that's why it was the best time to launch the swimsuits collection. So now we're focusing mostly on it, but still people still buying the shoes and the shirts. They're wearing them to the parties and events. They're tagging us and we are reposting everything, which making very exciting. That's fabulous. So you're growing very fast, right? <laughs> and 
And I mean, I, I saw in the shoes, for example, your name your, your, on, the, on the shoes and everything. So this is great because uh, a lot of people um, following you are following you as, from your past work uh, or, or as a DJ and everything. So are you still uh, in the music and everything? Yeah, I'm not a DJ. I produce the parties. I have my DJs that I manage. I produce the whole event from the music to the visuals to the close of the dancers. So yeah, I still work on it. I still produce events. Uh -huh. uh, but right now, the most focused thing I do is the closing collection. Of course. And um, talking about uh, a little bit again with a party, the Papa Party, what is new in this uh, upcoming parties? I mean, uh, Uh, new DJs or uh, what, what is uh, what gonna be the surprises for the new parties? So every time we're launching a new concept, actually I'm combining now the store, the swimsuits. The new concept will be Papa Beach. That everything is like swimsuit, so I'm gonna use this swimsuit collection together with the dancers. Sometimes I can do a like I'm gonna do a runway inside the party, so there is a like long stage and the models. Dancers will start to work with the collection. So it will be a collaboration of fashion, party, swimsuits, fun, um, mix of all together, which I love to connect stuff that I do. And when I see them coming all together, for me, it's something that I found. So that's fabulous because, I mean, that's an original concept and uh, people love to, to uh, see runaways and everything. So it's, it's a... It's a great idea, I think. So, congratulations. Thank you very much.